Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Nancy and I am a podcast manager for coaches and I also train virtual assistants how to start their businesses and how to transition into podcast management. If it's your first time to come across this face, I believe we are going to learn more about each other, we are going to interact, you are going to know what I do, what I have in store and why you should subscribe. So why have I decided to record this video today? By the way, it is the last day of 2022. It is the 31st of December 2022 and it's about 7 p.m. I believe. And the reason as to why I have decided to hop on here and record this video is because I just didn't want 2022 to come to an end before I have my first YouTube video published. So one of the things I had intended to do this year was to start a YouTube channel and to start a podcast. So um, it came to my realization that I am on the last day of the year and I haven't actualized the thing that I really wanted to do and it's mainly because I have been quite busy with client work, with my students, trying to train them on how to become virtual assistants, how to start their own uh, podcast management businesses and this being the last day of the year and I am not working today so I just decided let me just do this and get it out of the way. So there are three things I want to share with you today, actually four things. One, who I am, two, what I do, three, why I have decided to start this channel and four, my story on how I became a virtual assistant. So let's get started. Who am I? My name is Nancy Kwamboka. I am based in Nairobi, Kenya, and I am a podcast manager by trade and an electrical engineer by training. Well, reason as to why I am not pursuing that line is a story for another day, and I'll share it on this channel. And um, so number two, what do I do? I am a podcast manager. I know this will sound like repetition, but I just have to um, say it so that at least you get to understand more about me, get to know me more. Besides that, I am a mom to a very handsome little boy. I'm a wife and I love my family. I love that I belong to this beautiful, wonderful family that is happy, that is content, that is we just make uh, beautiful memories together and I am so glad to be here today. So what do I do? I help coaches launch their podcasts. I help them grow their podcasts and also I help them manage them effectively and efficiently. So what does podcast management entail? Well, as a podcast manager, one of the things that I do is I help clients make sure that they are audio sounds best and that they get out on time. So I help them with editing. Once they record, they hand over the recordings to me and I pick it up from there. So I'll go in, edit, write show notes, create promotional content. And also if a client wants to have guests on their show and they don't have the time to reach out to people that can be on their shows, I help with that. So besides that, I also have an online school where I teach women how to become virtual assistants and how to become podcast managers. Well, if you are interested in starting to work online, especially as a virtual assistant, feel free to join my group. It's on Facebook. It's a free group where I share tips on how to get started, how to learn clients and stuff like that. It's called Women Working Online as Virtual Assistants. Be sure to submit your request and I'll approve it. But then you have to answer all the questions that have been asked. Well, once now that that is out of the way, let's talk about why I have decided to start this channel. One, I want to share my story. I want as many women to know that it is possible to work from home. It is possible to start your own business as a virtual assistant, regardless of where you are. And yes, it's very possible to make a good amount of money and live a comfortable life. Yeah. Number two, I want to get to interact with uh, people in this online space. I want to share tips and tricks on how one can get started because I have done it and I know you can do it. 
there are so many reasons as to why I have decided to start this channel. Plus, I also want to document my journey. It's been six years since I was introduced to working online. Well, it's been a journey, it's six years, yeah. And I'm going on to my seventh year next year, and it's been been a bliss yeah of course there's there have been ups and downs but then a majority of it has been bliss because i have gotten to work with clients that i really love i have gotten to do what i really enjoy doing for me mondays are not like the typical mondays i actually look forward to mondays mainly because well i don't use an alarm to wake up because most of my clients are in the uk and in the us and as you might know if you're in kenya um the day starts it, like the days in the u.s start when hours are coming to an end so i really don't have to wake up early besides i work i work from home so i don't have to commute so there's no point in me waking up early well now let's get to my story how did i get started as a virtual assistant well in 2016 while i was still in college i was introduced to the space of working online and the person that introduced me was a blog writer so by default they introduced me to blog writing and i did that for quite a while until at some point i realized that this is not exactly something that i enjoyed doing i was doing it as a hassle because i was a student and you know as, as a student you're always broke you're looking for ways to make money so over time i got introduced to another um area of working online which is virtual assistance and i was able to get started with no experience mind you i hadn't graduated i was still a student so i was able to start as a virtual assistant i worked as a virtual assistant for about two three years until one of my clients who was uh, from the u.s he was a meditation teacher he decided to launch his podcast and by default i being his virtual assistant he asked me to research on what goes into uh, launching a successful podcast and that is how I was introduced to the world of podcasting mind you before then I had not heard anything about podcasts that was the very first time I was uh, learning about podcasts I was able to research I took a course on how to produce podcasts and I was able to help him launch his podcast and it's right now a very successful podcast and I'm really happy that the the, the space uh, like in the podcasting space was introduced to me in that manner since then i have worked with so many clients i have produced hundreds of podcasts and i have launched quite a number of them and i'm so glad that the world of podcasting exists because mainly because i really enjoy listening to podcasts and if the bonus that comes with that is making money out of something that i really enjoy then why not so that is how I was introduced to the world of podcasting. Since then, I have been able to train uh, a few ladies on how to get started as podcast managers and as virtual assistants. And some of them have been able to turn um, their business into full-time jobs. Well, one thing I've not mentioned is that while I was working as a virtual assistant, at the very beginning, I was doing it as a part-time gig, but over time, my business grew to the extent that I was able to quit my 9 to 5 because I felt that my virtual assistance was uh, something that if I dedicated my time to it, I would be able to grow it very fast and I would be able to do something that I really enjoy. So I quit my 9 to 5 and dived into the world of podcasting and this is what I do full time. And I am really looking forward to sharing with you the tips, the tricks, everything that goes into becoming a virtual assistant who specializes in podcast management. Just a heads up before I wind up on this video is that Virtual assistance is not easy, as some people may, pay, may, may paint a picture of it. It's a business just like any other. It requires you to dedicate your time, dedicate your resources, dedicate your energy to learning, to doing the work. But overall, it's something that I know you will really enjoy. So stay tuned for more. I'll be uploading an episode every week. I'll be uploading a video every week. So as we get into 2023 i hope you 
have a wonderful year i hope you live in abundance i hope your dreams are fulfilled so subscribe to this channel if you'd want to get tips if you'd want to get started as working as a virtual assistant if you'd want to uh, get information on how you can effectively grow your clients podcast and effectively manage them if you want to know how to find clients this is the place for you subscribe and i'll see you next week